The Isle of Scale, headquarters of the Ark Society. Founded by Janus in 1991, the Ark Society is the world's most exclusive club. Its plutocratic members fear the downfall of civilization, and they are willing to pay huge sums to ensure their own survival. Once a year, they gather here to shop the latest survival products and to showcase new initiatives and breakthroughs. Right. These gatherings are shrouded in mystery, so we have limited intel on what to expect on the other side of the halls. The Washington Twins are hosting their first annual gathering as chairwomen of the Ark Society, and the Constant is known to attend every year. Beyond that, you're on your own. Good luck, gentlemen. I dare say you're going to need it. symbolizes the collapse of civilization from which the Ark Society emerges unscathed and triumphant. Ah, rebirth. I get Interesting. Zoe Washington is going to partake in a ceremony symbolizing the downfall of civilization from which the Ark Society will emerge unscathed. Apparently, a giant phoenix-shaped effigy is set on fire with Zoe inside it. Well... I suggest you locate this master of ceremonies who lights the Fire 47. If this doesn't sound like an accident waiting to happen, I don't know what does. What's new is that the master of ceremonies will light the effigy of the fire. Good smell, I agree. Washington won't be able to escape. What sort of a maniac would lock herself inside a burning effigy without proper measures?
Seriously, I'll, I'll pay you. Me? You're the master of ceremony. I'm a multiple Tony award-winning playwright. And famously reclusive. It's part of my brand. I never go in the spot like this. Besides, I do chamber plays. Spectacle. But people hate it. They won't hate it, Mr. Feniger. It's just entertainment. Entertainment? What have I done? Did I let her talk me into this? Should I tell Miss Washington that you won't be going on stage? Everyone's waiting for you. God, no. No, she frightens me. Just, uh, just, just give me a moment to control the nurse. All right, Mr. Vinegar. Regular. Phone ring that I have the schedule in my hand. Just think, you idiot. A handsome pledge, and yet, a drop in the ocean. Zoe Washington, the Ark Society recognizes you as our founder's rightful successor, our inspiration, our guiding light, the custodian of our future. Excellent work, 47. Enjoy the spotlight. Patrons of the Ark Society, ah, right. you are part of a select, chosen few. Our founder, Janus, showed us how to survive. But survival is not enough. We must live, and we must soar. The Ark Society oh, sure. must not only commit itself to survival, but to progress. Be it our next home in the stars, or the next step in human evolution. This is the eternal purpose of the elite. Not just elite, 
but to lead from the front. When the time comes, and all comes tumbling down, when mankind retreats once more into caves of superstition, we will keep the fire alight. We will be the torchbearers, the trailblazers and pioneers. Do, do not feel guilty for your privilege. Be proud. Be fearless. For the future is ours to shape. Look at you, Fenneker. All dressed to kill. Now, let's do this thing. Light her up. As the world burns, we rise from its ashes, not just to survive, but to live. Nice work, 47. Next up, Sophia Washington. So, according to its charter, the Ark Society collects priceless art and historical artifacts in case of a global disaster. And this year, world-famous treasure hunter Blake Nathaniel has donated an Aztec necklace called the Cloud Serpent to the Ark Society's growing collection. However, Blake fears that Sophia Washington, his former lover and rival, who has hunted the Cloud Serpent for years, will attempt to steal it for herself before it goes into storage. Hmm. Could be just the bait we need. Why the need for the lungs? Where? I'm in shock. Evening. And you give all that up just to get my attention. Or you will I'll be sorry. Are we breaking up, Sophia? I I can't really tell. <clears throat> Piss off, Blake. I like the mask, hmm. Vinegar. Wonder if the castle's basements could house a perm. Security's all in place? Outstanding. The cloud serpent is safe from sticky fingers. Open casket, Murray. Are you serious? Janice died two months ago. What did they do? Mama bite? Not bite. It's called vaccination. The more you take it.
Good evening, sir. Smooth, 47. The Sparrow's got nothing on you. Sharp, Benninger. Wait a minute. Oh, that is just oh, the audacity of that one. You, Miss Nathaniel. What am I looking at? Why, that's a. Oh my. But it's gone. It can't be with the alarm. Expertly disabled, I assume. But there was someone here the whole time. And besides, stealing from the Order? No Ark member would be so foolish or disrespectful. The patrons neither. Maybe one of the custodians took it to be polished or... Oh, no, no, no. I know exactly what happened. Or who happened. You do? Who's the culprit? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. All right, I'll take care of this. Back to work. Whatever the hell it is you do around here. Command? Yeah, sir. I need some backup over in the gallery. We've had a situation. Over. Mm-hmm. Oh, another one. I should have my mercs toss you out on your ass. <laughs> oh, nice try, Sophia. But you can't expel an ARC member. Hello, sir.
some contemporary pieces. Is it... Sophia. Blake? I almost didn't recognize you without a knife in my back. I messed up. I see that now. Can we talk? <laughs> this should be good. Follow me. Yeah, hi, how are you? Excellent, 47. Let's give Sophia her heart's desire, shall we? You've got one minute. Looking tremendous today, sir. I did wrong by you, Sophia. I see that now, and I want to make amends. Here, this is rightfully yours. Well, well. Look who comes crawling back. Leave us. You know, we lost three men because of you. Wickus was crushed by a rolling boulder. Jaco fell into a pit trap. And Zoe and me, we only escaped the arrows by using one of the local guides as a human shield. Now, this is a nice gesture. It doesn't even begin to make amends. I know. May I? Fine. But not too tight. You know, I thought about sending the boys after you. Grab the necklace and cut your throat ear to ear. Both targets down. Impressive work, 47. And now, to confront the Constant. Mr. Gray, what's your status? I'm at the helicopter, but the place is crawling with security. 47, you better bring the Constant to the harbor where it's less crowded. You can hijack one of the Archean boats. Question is how? He's not likely to come quietly. Unless you get your hands on a kill switch. Yes. That might just work. Search one of the twins, 47. The Washingtons are dead. I have the kill switch. What did you say? How could you know about that? You will head towards the harbor. No sudden moves. No signs or warnings. I will trigger the device if I need to. I know you. The boy in the picture. You have his eyes. You're Barnwood's assassin. Move. Maybe the pitch would land better, but as it is, I just can't imagine buying it. You might as well have left out the pumpkin seeds and dried coconut. Oh, partners no more. Oh, I don't mind it. me, sir. I had a notion something didn't sit right with my mentor's betrayal. You murdered him, I take it, to get to me. Not just that. He had it coming. Interesting. It was my impression that you were cured of such sentiment. The good doctor built his serum specifically to target the seats of your emotions. Has Miss Burnwood's sense of justice rubbed off on you? I wonder. Just keep walking. For what it's worth, but the fact Janus is, always yeah, found Ortmeier's project distasteful time, and mention inefficient. But alas, sometimes you have to play the hand you're dealt. Oh, I know.
take it this is not an ICA sanctioned operation. What exactly does Miss Burnwood plan to achieve by targeting her clients? Violating her own code? She's doing it for us. I mean, us. show a little respect, right? The oh, I see. The penny drops. I should have known. How does a man leave no trace? By not existing in the first place. Lucas Gray. Or was it Subject 6? He died when the Institute went up in flames, but no body was ever produced. And unlike you, his rage never faded. So, now you want the partners, the men behind the curtain that have caused you all this pain. Well, before you go knocking down a wall, you better make sure it's not a wall.